Hello, this is Christopher Adams here, author of the book Spanish Cedar, Preserving the Art of the Cigar Experience. And today I'm going to talk to you about one of those experiences that's a little frustrating. Yesterday I uh, popped open a uh, J Fuego, Edición de Familia. And I used to think that the little cap in the end meant that it was airtight. And I used to think that any of these would automatically be fresh because they were sealed. But um, I found out that this is just decor. So I don't know what this is. A Maduro I picked up somewhere in Brevard County, Florida, but it's better than that Fuego. That Fuego crackled. The head and shoulders of the stick broke. The draw was wretched. The flavor was non-existent because it was so apparently broken up because of the access of the uh, all the air coming in because the leaf wasn't together. So anyway, I had to take the advice of one of my good friends, owner and manager of Paradise Cigars in Rock Lake, Florida, and he said, I've already wasted my money. I'm not going to waste my time. So I didn't try to bring the Fuego back to life. So I've got two more of these little rascals. I'm going to take them out of their little cylinders. I'm going to put them in my humidor. And I'm going to see if they will freshen up, come back to life. Um, sometimes it, it works, I understand. So we'll see how it goes. And uh, if it does, then uh, you'll see on a tweet that I'll be talking about that and um, discussing how, how the rescue of Jay Fuego uh, made my life better, made my day better, and created an enjoyable afternoon for me uh, and my cup of coffee and uh, my stick. So... I hope you have a nice afternoon, enjoy your cigar, and uh, this is Christopher Adams, the author of Spanish Cedar, Preserving the Cigar Experience.